sequestrum. It's the part of the bone which is entrapped within the pus. It's devoid of vascular supply and thus becomes dead. Sequestrum appears more radiopaque because of the dystrophic calcification, meaning calcification in the, ne in the, in the tissue uh, which uh, has necrosis. Uh, dystrophic calcification as a result of increased carbon dioxide and thus altering the pH and attracting more calcium and also because of the decreased remodeling of the calcium from the dead tissues. Hence, it requires surgical removal as sequestrum may be revascularized, remain quiescent or dormant, and it can also reabsorb or get infected chronically. Uh, this picture belongs to a 30-year-old, 38-year-old female who was a victim of domestic violence and she presented uh, herself at the clinic with this, which is the exposed uh, sequestrum along with obliteration of the vest obliteration of the uh, gingiva and the alveolar mucosa. This is uh, an example of the maxillary osteomyelitis and this is uh, this case was actually said to be very rare. In volucrum, sequestrum can be surrounded by a new reactive immature bone known as the involucrum. It is formed at the, uh, at the strip periosteum due to the subperiosteal abscess. Sometimes channels are formed in the involucrum from which pus are drained out known as the cloacae and involucrum are less radiodense than the sequestrum.